Hi there, Adam Gray again, and my apologies in advance for those of you who might be a little bit squeamish, but I am in the process of donating blood right now, and blood makes me think about MCAT science, because the entire conversation about donating blood and so on centers around blood types, and blood types are all about antigens and antibodies. Antigens are little molecules that are on the plasma mem membranes of cells that act as little ID tags for those cells. And antibodies are little molecules in your body that attack cells that have certain antigens on them. Now that's good, that's how your immune system works, but what is the problem is when you get blood from someone who has antigens that you don't. Let's say you have O-type blood, and the person you're getting blood from has A-type blood, then that blood is going to have A antigens on it, and you're going to have antibodies to the A antigen in your blood, and that's going to be bad, because the whole point of getting blood uh, is that you keep the blood. But what would happen in that case is that you would, your body would attack those cells, and um, all sorts of bad things would happen. That's why blood type is important, and blood type is really fascinating in a lot of ways. I mean, um, you've got AB, you've got AB, you've got universal donors, that's O negative, you've got universal acceptors, that's AB positive, all sorts of good stuff. And the whole thing has a really interesting genetic makeup as well. It's a system of co-dominance for A, B, and O blood types. That's a conversation for another video. Anyway, thank you for watching. Good luck on your test. Keep thinking about science. And if you're eligible, please do donate blood. Saves lives. Bye.